Hi, this is the Daily Overpass. My name is Eric and I make apps. Now today, I wanna talk about dealing with stress while coding. Okay, so it is a cold morning here today in England. Yeah, I mean, it is, ooh, it is brisk. I forgot to bring my gloves this morning. But this morning I thought I would answer a question that came in last week, last Sunday, from, uh, from Jamil Dumaran. And it was just a really simple one. How do you deal with stress while coding? Right, now, I, I was thinking about this. This is something we all deal with. We all deal with stress while coding. And I was, I was trying to think, what you actually meant by that because there's different there's different ways there's there's like stress on a project we have a project that's going badly and dude I could tell you some stories and I'm sure that I will times where you just think this is not gonna work this is a train wreck this is you know, everything's gonna go completely wrong right and there's times where it's just the day-to-day -day stress while coding and you know th there's a few reasons why, why you, you have this kind of stress you know number one is you have like a really tight deadline and you need to get something done and you just have to, you know, you're just, I just need to get this done, right? Or you have a bug. And if you have a bug, you know, and, you know, it's, it, somebody could point it out to you or, you know, you just find it yourself and you could spend, you know, you could spend five minutes fixing that bug or you could spend 10 hours or 20 hours or this thing, thing that keeps going on and on again. And it drives you crazy. And sometimes you just have stuff that just doesn't work the way that it should. You've done everything you're supposed to, and for whatever reason, it's not working, right? And if it's if the stress is due to really tight time constraints, like you have a really tight deadline, a lot of times you can't do a lot of the things that that really help me out. Like for me, getting some exercise helps. And I know it, you know, it just going for a walk sometimes is, is all you have to do. Sometimes, and but mostly it's just getting away from the code, right? For me, you know, the amount of times I fix things while I've gone to the bathroom and I just I just carry got away from it got away from the code because I was too close to it and I was too stressed and I just wanted to I wanted to throw the computer out the window I mean just really angry I mean I'll sit there in the office by myself and swear and, and curse and just like oh you know just you know and you know luckily there's nobody else in there usually although there there will be very soon right so you know, they have the, so sometimes I'll be walking to the bathroom and I'll be thinking God, you know, I've, ch I've checked everything. I, I can't figure out why this thing's, I, you know, I've fixed everything. And I think, God, you know what? But when did this problem first occur? And then I'll, you know, I'll start going back in my head and I'll say, oh, hang on a second, you know, this wasn't ever, because most of the time if it's a bug, it's usually, it's either something's changing the code or it's something environmental. There's nothing else, right? This is either something's changed in the environment, you know, like a, an update to the platform or, or whatever, the internet connection was there and it's not there, blah, 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 right? Or it's something in the code where you made one little change somewhere and for you cannot comprehend how it would affect this other thing, but you have to work your way back through that. So that, so for those of you who don't know what it's like to have a bug and to be really stressed by it, you have to watch the movie uh, Christmas Vacation. So if you've ever seen the movie Christmas Vacation with Chevy Chase, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation, one of my favorite Christmas movies, well, there's this part where he goes out and he sets up this huge Christmas light display at the house. Like, he does everything over the top. So he goes, all these lights and all these decorations and it's the biggest thing on the whole neighborhood and everything. All over the roof, the whole house is covered in lights and he has this big celebration with the family. They all come up, they're shivering, kind of like I am this morning. And he says, you know, all right, ready? He's gonna push the button. Hallelujah. And then nothing happens, right? And then he does it again and again. And then he just, you know, he tries a few more things. It's pretty logical. And then he, he completely loses it. And he just like starts kicking things and he's punching the Santa Claus and everything like that. Right? And, uh, you know, and then like a, few, like a few days later, you know, they're coming out. He's still trying to figure out what it is. He said, why don't you come on inside? He says, no, you know, I, 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 I can't figure out what it is. I, you know, I, I honestly can't. And they're, and they're like, and everybody else say, well, maybe it's a loose bulb because I've, I've manually checked every bulb, right? And then, uh, and then later on, somebody walks into like the, um, like, uh, like some laundry room or something and flips on a switch to, to get the light and then the whole house lights up. It was just a switch, right? And then he switches it off and then he loses it again because he can't figure out what it was, right? That's what it's like when you're, when you're, searching for a bug right sometimes it's just something really small and you t if you're too close to it if you don't get away from it because the stress and everything you will tear that code apart right you will completely you know uh, and I've done this I've done this where you know th and this is why 
Git and uh, source code repositories are really important because you know when you're really under the gun, you will you will change everything. You'll say, I have no idea why this is not working now, where it was working yesterday, but it's obviously I need to change the entire way this is done. Obviously, I need to add this, add this, and you'll go down these forums and you'll get all these red herrings and tell you all this other kind of stuff. So, it can be stressful coding. Don't let anybody fool you. But you know, for me, the biggest thing is just to get away from it. Get away from it, and as much as you can, because I know I've gone home from work thinking about the bugs. I've gone home from work thinking about, you know, this thing, and people are like, are you angry about something? Oh, no, no, not, no, not, no, I'm, I'm fine. It's just this thing at work. So anyway, I, yeah, I know that doesn't help. If you, well, get away from it, do some exercise if you can. I know that sounds corny, but it really helps me. And uh, anyway, so that's it for today. I'll talk to you, oh, yeah, no, 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 no. What do you guys do? Because I, you know, your experiences are gonna be different. How do you deal with the stress of coding? Or do you even feel any stress at all? So. Anyway, that's it for today. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.